If you have ever seen a radio or a television that's opened or even a mobile phone, you see something like this in it. This is an integrated circuit. So, after humans have suffered the pains of trying to store information on computers, another generation surfaced. This time, the computers could be moved easily but not as quickly as we do these days. In this class, we would see how computers begin to reduce in size as we age from generation to generation. It was between 1964 to 1977. The third generation of computers were introduced. It uses IC, integrated circuit. It is quite obvious that the size of the computer got further reduced. Computers of this generation were small in size, low cost, large memory, and processing speed was very high. Along the line, ICs were replaced by LSI, Large Scale Integration, which consisted of about 100 components. In conclusion, the third generation of computers used integrated circuits. They were small in size, low cost, large memory, and processing speed was very high. Thank you for your time. See you in the next class.